Okay, a uh, gigantic 60-something person or as tour, uh, ran that tour. Not winning a single game in the last tour really smacked my standings on the leaderboard. But it's fine. Clay it all. So, this is not a good mini matchup. So it's just like an attacker. Um, I think I like Dugong here. Yeah, Shadow Sneak is very valuable. Omega Maw Wiles, it's really good. I think it's really good. Didn't get banned. I don't know. That did a lot more than I wanted it to. Um, Ice Beam is just technically better in all senses of the word. So I want a Toxic. Just see what I can hit. Do I have any mods that protect? I have a Lomola. That's hype. That's not. I wait. Why did I think I should want the toxic? It's fine. Wait, I can just toxic for this guy. I'm gonna heal my dugong. Holy cow! I need to pay more attention to what my team is. Yeah, I hope he doesn't get. I hope he either switches or. Toxic and Wish. Hope he doesn't get up rocks here. I'm very okay with having Toxic on a Lomola. It's just gonna Wish Path all pass all game. That's fine with me. Uh, Okay. So in theory, Muck is absolutely free. Uh, gunk shot. Because Claydol is entry for a Lomola. Which means I can possibly heal up the Dugong. Okay, a fire blast on you. In games like these, when you have a big threat uh, that you want to get in, you try and get that threat in as many times as possible. Mega Mawile. I'm thinking about what going to it. I don't have a spinner. So plus two um plus two fire fang is dealing almost a kill. It's fifty percent chance to Oko. How fast is it? It's slower than Claydol. Let's Claydol in, which I can go to the one. I'm okay with this. And I absorb knockoff, which my Gudra would not have done. Can I SD up here? Because it, it can't touch me. That's fine. 
right? Ha! You're probably Scarf Eruption too. Just gonna EQ. Do I have a Stealth Rock Setter? No, I don't. Okay, it does have Dazzling Gleam. Dazzling Gleam Psychic. I can always Revenge with Swellow. Mawila looks kind of free. Uh, I can just throw off a play rough here. It's fine if I hit into Ferris or Ferrothorn. Die. Because I can, um... Wait, you're gonna do that again? What does Teflosion get that hits? I'm just gonna go to Loma Lola this time. In case you do something like that, and I wish. And I can wish past whatever. Because you got a Ferrothorn? Oh boy, how do you, you wanna see? You wanna see Mega Mawile get back to pretty much full health? Boom. That feels good. Wait, so, uh... Oh, goodness. I didn't need to... Cal I was cal cal kicking on with Mega Maw while Fire Fangs just kills this thing. Probably. I like Udra here. And that was really hasty of me. Should have probably taken the 50% Oko. I was just worried. I do tank the Kale. Cherim's faster than me, but it can only HP fire. So this thing eternally walls Cherim to Typhlosion. Uh, what are you gonna do? Get EQ'd? No, Alumbola is probably safer. Even if it's in Power Grass, I just switch back to Gudra. And if it's not, I wish past Gudra. Alumbola is so nice on this team. Okay. Gudra it is. This is nice. This is really nice having good Pokemon on my team. I wonder what his Mega is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can pretty much only turn Dragon Tail here. You got Dazzling Gleam. Didn't realize that was one of your options. I want to see what your last is. We're speed tying. Um. I go all over Lola here and click wish. I love this mod. Yeah, sorry dude. I think you get stalled by a Lola wish pat like it switches in wishes. See so what you what you do, like if you're playing in a scenario against uh this Lola, what you do is you send in clay all. My response has been Alomola like five times. You send in clay at all, double tier cherum. Uh, well, you get at rocks if you have them anywhere. Um, double tier cherum, or your last if your last is any good on the predicted Alomola. And if you threaten the Alomola out to prevent it from uh, getting a wish off, I am losing. Not much health. Like, I don't lose health because of the regenerator. I'll just switch out. But I don't reverse your progress. And then you can make permanent progress on these mons. Rather than getting Gudra healed up to full. And Mawile healed up to full. So Stealth Rock is a really good play here. 
means my dugong's essentially dead. It's called. Just gonna go to Gudra. Hmm. No, I'm gonna go to Muck. This Cherum really doesn't make progress against my team. That was a crit. I don't think Shadow Sneak kills it, but I can gunk shot. I can gunk shot into Shadow Sneak. Uh, I definitely got the team advantage on this game. Absolutely, but I do think I played well enough. Uh, there were some big misplays, like keeping a Dugon for too long when a little Molo was a safe response. Memento, please don't sub. Okay. <laughs> yeah, it's just instant Memento. I don't really know what this thing is going to do to me. I don't like it at all. Um, Mega Mall. See, like, I've been getting my Mall Island and threatening with it and throughout the entire game. And now he finally reveals his big threat, which, like, it's a nice reveal and all. But the problem with that is he could have been getting this in all, like, earlier in the game and been threatening more. Um, Dugong. Dugong Surf does break this up. might have like sucker punch or something fire fang focus punch sucker punch is an option I don't know why you go for sub there And calking, uh, just facade, raw facade on Mega Maw Wheelie. I should probably be using my calc display a little more. Uh, regular facade is mm, when I'm not badly poisoned, is doing 13% minimum. I'm fine. And it's probably Scarf Typhlosion, but then I get uh, Gudra in for free. Good facade. Yeah, it's Scarfed. No need to click faster here. Now I EQ. And take a kill. There's no way this thing gets past Gudra level Mola. I got some really good defensive pivots, which really helps how I play the game. Um, pivoting and just defensive mons as a backbone is uh, just like my preferred way to play the game. Focus Blast was not breaking this team. But that was, that was really fun. Also, this is in the lobby, not um, in uh, uh, words, runes of Valve. Uh, Groudon is scary. Fake out is free. We have life orb. I hate life orb fake out. I don't understand. You're just taking so much unnecessary damage. Do I have at least? Con Ugh, I do not. Well, uh, Lukia is probably as good as make. It's a crowd on response that I will ever get. Now I toxic you. That's fine. I am multi scale. And now I click roost. Yeah, see? So. Um. Yeah. Fun stuff, right? 
Sorry, you make a ground on. This is why you don't go. Uh, this is why you don't go for such turn one winning the game plays when your opponent's team is revealed. Slash Randbats Clef key. Does it? It does have spikes. T wave. Uh, toxic would be really bad on Lugia. Don't have a spinner, but I have a Magnezone. Woo boy, we take those. Uh, Thunderbolts actually might be a little. I don't know if it's stronger in this generation. Oh, of course it is, because Envir Nerf. Wait, I'm specs. I should have uh, flashed. Maybe flash cannon. No, it's fine. I will eventually break the Clef key. I just want it to be when there's not a screen up. I think I always just go Lugia here. Because I am faster. Oh, Fire Punch Burn could be really bad. I'm gonna Calc Arrow Blast. Lugia versus Primal Groudon. Arrow Blast is 30%. I click Roost. Uh, no use getting stone edged. Persian is. I think it's hypnosis stuff. Oh no, it's just like trying you to knock off. I do not want it to get knock off. In theory, it's walled by Magnazone. Flash cannon. Just so I hit ground on if it comes in. Am I faster? No, I'm not. He gets a one turn window for a Stone Edge crit or a Fire Punch burn. Gorbish slash and that Gorbis. Toxic. How much is Gorbis doing to my Lugia at plus two? Ice Beam is a 40%. Arrow Blast is doing 30%. Um, hmm. Could just whirlwind it here. Celebi can't touch me, but it could potentially T-wave me. And I really quite don't want that to happen. So what do you do here? You switch your T-wave, right? No way he goes for a grass move. I'm just going to check for T-wave. You went on the grass move. It's gonna hurt. Okay, perfect. Um, Dredagon is good as Mold Breaker, so I just fake out. I like keeping this mod for later. Fake out is nice. It could save me against a uh, Gorbis sweep. So it's just like an all-out attacker. Could, ooh, rocks. I do not want rocks to get up. At all. Rocks up would be really bad for my Lugia. Am I, is it in range for Needle King Ice Beam? Not at all. Hello. Discover card here to explain our cashback match. We match all of the cash back you return. end of your first year automatically. Just punish it's rocks. That simple. Discover exceptionally common sense. Learn more at discover.com/match. Limitations. Knock in case he switches. 
Um, Switch to Liberty Mutual and save six hundred and fifty-two dollars. Yeah, here's the thing. So Persian can fake out me, fake out U-turn stuff. Um, Latias is probably my win condition. Groudon dies. I'm going to Volt Switch. Because I flashed Cannon last time. So he might uh, just go to Gorbis. Or he just uh, goes with a return. What mons do I have that are faster than you? None. Lantern it is. Thunderbolt it is. It's called better probably. No, because the T-Bolt is Corpus. It's fine, it's toxic. Right, because water moves don't work in this generation sometimes. Sack Magnazone. He's faster. He fakes out. I click Scald. No, I clicked. I clicked Evil. It's fine. Oh, that's actually rather nice. Nido King comes in and clicks Sludge Wave. Okay, I definitely had the matchup advantage again. Like pretty, pretty big, pretty much. Like, I don't think Psychic just kills me, but either way. Yeah, uh, so that Shell Smash Gorbis is scary. The w best way for him to have threatened to win was uh, get Dragon in early, and then keep forcing my Lugia down with Gorbis over and over. Um, and after forcing the it down with Gorbis, then go to Groudon and try and stone edge your way through, and then after that you have a clean press of the blade sweep. But then again, it's really hard to tell which mon is your win condition in certain games, but like, until enough of your opponent's team is revealed, which is why I could tell that like, my win condition is this Mega? No, it's not. What's my Mega? How do you know? Dang it! Dang it! Uh, this looks like yeah, he thinks I have Mega thing, um, but I, I'm just gonna Diamond Storm here. No, I'm, I'm gonna Stealth Rock. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna Stealth Rock as he switches. I should have just Diamond Stormed. I'm an idiot. Don't have a switch into this, do I? I don't. I don't. I just don't. This takes a kill. Please close combat me. Please close combat me. Die! What? That didn't kill? Huh? Excuse me? I should have just diamond stormed. Ugh. I would have lost zero mons if um, I diamond stormed there. I fire punch in case you switch to a ghost. Dang it. That pisses me off. He's just probably going to spin. But I just deoxys stall time. Yep. I just thought he wouldn't risk pincer turn one like that. But I guess uh, I can take the GSE standby of uh, being patient to get up your entry hazards. Let's go. I do get the predict right. Oh, well, taunting does literally nothing here. Can I set up Audino on this thing? Oh, wait, it's a fighting type. Just make Audino. I don't know these things. 
Toxic again. Toxic again. You can just switch. Sir, you can just switch. Into this. What does Swalla do? Can encore me. I don't like that. I'm gonna taunt you. <laughs> I don't like that. Poison would be irritating. Hmm, it's life orb. Don't want to knock it off then. Maybe I do. Oh, that's rude if you poison here. She can recover. So I don't. Hmm. How much does I? How much does Swalot do against Audino, not Mega, with Life Orb? Doing like 36 to Audino. So after a couple call lines, I should be fine. I'm slower, so he could just encore me into call mine, which is unfortunate. Calm mind. I should have wished here. Die. Wasn't my hip on top? The hip on top internally, eternally walled. I feel like it was. I'm gonna let it kill me. Just so that I can do this. Guaranteed to just heal up my Deoxys. This is gonna be a pretty long game. I would rather, uh, I'd particularly not like to lose. Kingdra in the late game could be really good. And I click recover. No, I just click taunt. Because he might switch. Ew. Uh, how much is U-turn doing? Ninjask versus Deoxys Defense is doing 90 something per se. Oh, it's Choice Band. Choice Band is almost a guaranteed kill on my Deoxys Defense. Okay, how about on Audino? Audino Mega, it's not doing much at all. Night Slash, 25, that's probably banded. Mega, Fire Blast. What does Samurai do? And that's Samurai. here. No, I can't. Mind. I thought it was a waterfall and it flinched for a second. And I'm like, wait, dang it. I wish it was just a pure fairy type. But superpower would be its strongest move. Potential move. So how much uh, 
Ninja Ninjask did n 25 to normal Audino. Is that banded? Audino. Night Slash did 25. Yeah, so that is banded. It's strongest moved aerial ace that does a maximum of 25. I'm just gonna wish here because I can get a Deoxys defense on something weird. Okay, I caught mine here. He needs like a. I was gonna say a Stone Edge crit. Samurott can't touch me, and Jessica can't touch me. He doesn't have another Mega. He's got a Kirim, though. Click Dazzling Gleam. Why does this thing not get Moonblast? That's depressing. Ice Beam, no freeze. Do it again. Yeah, this is this is my preferred way to play, is that I have these threats, but I also have defensive mons, and my threats are useful. Because I don't I don't like being just ran over by some stray what's its bucket wish to be safe. Get in case of like waterfall flinches. Always wish here. Dazzling Gleam. I should have probably should have Dazzling Gleam there. Now I'm just gonna wish. Whew. I thought he'd actually do it. Yeah, I was, I was getting ever more worried about just getting. Uh, if this thing gets down to 40. I should probably just switch. Like without getting a wish up, I should switch because this is my ninjask answer. <laughs> this is pulling a Jirachi. Stop Jirachiing me! I should. Uh, if I okay, if I didn't get the wish off there, I need to go to Kingdra. This is in crit range. <sighs> if you did okay, if I don't get the wish off here, I go to Kingdra. Crit range, and he's in Torrent. If that flinches, I have to switch because Aqua Jet. Oh wait, no, I, I would be able to wish anyways. Wow, he really dirtied me. <laughs> that was a lot of flinches. I think I played that reasonably okay. Lantern versus Jirachi, let's look at the team. Uh, this is probably sub fun. Yeah, this is sub fun. That is uh, a threat. Okay, Mega Salamance is gonna be the big threat of the game. Ice is a really scary typing to switch into. Uh, as such, I want to uh, preserve Jirachi as my only ice move at <laughs> Zibzir, my only ice switch in. Uh, Lantern. Jirachi, Lantern. Only Hydro Pump breaks a sub. Scald might break a sub. That's iffy. Do I want this body slam parrot? I, I want chip on this thing. Let's see, let's get some information. So he does get the lucky number. Para, 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 para. No burn, no burn. Come on! Crit, burn, and I don't get the para. Well, there goes my eye switch in. Para, please. 
just para him. Just para him. Oh my goodness. I think this might just 6 me. Mm, Sims is faster, please don't sub. This will break the sub. I just don't want to miss Fire Blast. Is he encoring? He's t bolting any crits. Okay, he's going to uh, Lantern almost definitely. Even if he just T-bolts here, I can pivot. That does really piss me off, though. Going for scald here. I don't have scald switchins. Does Salamence Draco Meteor do it? Not at all. Not even close. Just thirty-eight percent. I'm just gonna EQ here. Probably. I need. I need. Just need to set up with freaking uh, Tyrantrum as soon as possible. Toxic Orb. That means trick stuff. Just gonna knock off. I do potentially just lose. Sigalith versus Tyrantrum. Can you touch me? How many DVs are you gonna let me get off? Plus one head smack kills. Just it just kills. I should not risk getting tricked to Toxic Orb. I just don't want to miss any head smashes now. <laughs> or lock into outrage. Arceus Grass? You have an Arceus Grass? Uh, Arceus Grass. Plus one head smash is just a kill. It's just a kill. Hit. I'm pissed. I'm pissed. I'm I'm just upset. I'm just upset. Very late time. And just need like a crit or something dumb. That was extremely unlucky. I've just not been getting a lucky game. It's fine. I'll live. I have to like Draco here, otherwise it just kills every mod on my team with Ice Beam.
But yeah, um, playing for, like, standings is, like, makes it harder to have a lot of fun here. Oh, I was really going to be pissed if it was a Mega DNC. Die. I don't, I don't understand why you Mega Evolve there. I just lose. I just lose here, don't I? Can Torterra live one? She's got a Shaman Sky with HP Ice. Dang it. Uh, Shaman Sky, HP Ice is doing... How much to Torterra? Hit your Stone Edge, boy. Hit your Stone Edge. Oh, we take those. Well, you win some, and you... So, Tyrantrum did just win the game. If it hits that head smash. <laughs> Unfortunate. Well, okay, that's fine. It's random battles. That's also just got a little unlucky. Yeah, I won two games. Yeah, this was uh, this was a decent one. Good to know that lobby holds room towards now. Well, peace. Sometimes you miss. Sometimes you don't. Sometimes you face uh, Mega Lucario Palkia. At least today was not that day. <laughs>